Did you know that over 115,000 Mexicans chose to stay in the land stolen by the USA during the Mexican-American War? The Mexican-American War was a conflict fought between Mexico and the United States of America between 1846 and 1848 and resulted in over 55% or more than half of Mexico's territory being stolen. The conflict was due to European Americans wanting more land in order to expand slavery and the absurd policy known as Manifest Destiny. However, as the war ended, a new problem arose for these would-be colonizers, that being that hundreds of thousands of Mexican civilians still resided in these territories. This dilemma prompted the US government to force the Treaty of Guadalupe Hidalgo on the local residents. The treaty stated that the locals either renounce their Mexican citizenship within a year or become US citizens or vice versa. What the US treaty did not mention, however, was the fact that Mexicans who became American citizens would not be protected from Europe European Americans and the federal government from taking their farmlands, ranches, businesses, and homes by force. Unfortunately, this exact situation happened as tens of millions of Europeans flooded this newly acquired territory. Most Mexicans, however, refused to give up their belongings and were forcibly removed. Regardless, 115,000 stayed, mainly because they did not want to split up their families or leave the only lands they knew. Now fast forward 175 